Hello YouTube, I'm so today I'm going to be comparing the 2018, well, yeah, 2018 um, Walmart sh Shaking Clown versus the 2024 Walmart Shaking Clown. So this is actually my first Halloween animatronic. I got it in 2018 at Walmart, though it is from 2016 according to the tag. But I'm going to be referring it to as being from 2018. So here's a little, little close-up of his face. And that's what he does. Please get me down from here. I can't take hanging around anymore. Uh, so that, that was his demo. Um, his clothes are a bit like flimsy and not that great quality but the chains on him have are actually really good as but I do not like the fact that it uh the thing that goes around his hands the shackles or whatever is cloth I don't I don't know the hands have a lot of really nice detail as well as the face it's got a lot of really cool detail that I like um I believe this may have been made by Seasonal Visions, but I don't know. Could also be just like a Sunstar prop. Um, but it's pretty cool. So let's take a look at the one that I have from 2024. Now this has been sold for a few years prior. And um, it is pretty spooky. Now unlike this one, he um, is not motion activated. Now this one isn't supposed to be motion activated either. You're supposed to press there. But the button has broke since this thing is like six years old. So he's motion activated or whatever. Sound, I don't know. So this guy over here, he, you can only turn him on by the press of this button. Um, so a little demo of him. Um, so yeah, that's what he does. He has that clown music in the background, which I feel like is more fitting. But then again, let's spot some differences. So first of all, the clothing material is better quality, I would say, sort of. He has hips, unlike this guy, he's just like a stick over here. Um... There's a lot more detailing on the clothing rather than just being plain, all the blood spots. There's two buttons, but the thing is, this guy is shorter in the legs. Um, he also has purple hair. That's a very noticeable difference on him. And he is button activated, but unlike this one, the button, of course, is hanging down. Um, and then the face, again, it's really detailed. I really love the detail on this guy. Um, I love the detail on all props, and then his hands are also pretty detailed. I do not like the fact that the chains are sort of like a, like a orange color. Like, they're trying to make it look like rust, but it does not look that good. So, and also, they're very thin and cheaper than the other prop. And the thing that's holding the shackles is just a slim little string. So, I don't like that either. The hands have a bit more de a bit of detail on, on them but honestly um out of the two I prefer I actually have no preference because both of them have defections uh, not defections but like things that do not uh make them too qual good of quality but then again they both do have things that do do give them good quality if this guy didn't have such a slim body I would prefer him over this one. Then, then again, this one, I don't like the hip. So, anyways, thanks for watching, and uh, goodbye.